Hi, I'm Nancy Norberg. I am the coordinator for the Douglas Food Pantry. Douglas Food Pantry is a local organization um, here to support families that are in need. Um, and not only families that are uh, desperate in need, but just to uh, supplement their um, income. We want people to feel comfortable here. I know it takes a, a lot of courage to come down here and admit that you need help, but that's what we're here for. Uh, we don't want anyone to feel that they're embarrassed or um, that they're a failure or anything. Um, we try to you know, maintain dignity and, and support people for the help that they need. I think hunger is a problem everywhere. Families always have to be fed I mean, people know how much it is to feed a family and you know, go to the grocery store and every week that food needs to be replenished so there definitely is a need. Anyone in Douglas is eligible it just happens to be located here at the church. It's, you don't have to belong to the parish in order to um, use, utilize the food pantry. Pretty much anybody that is in need of food to supplement their household supply. There is not a fee for any family that needs food. I've seen a big increase in the usage of the food pantry, not only with families that are um, desperately in need, but of families who have lost jobs or lost hours in their jobs and are feeling the, the pinch of the economy. We serve between anywhere between 60 and 75 families, depending on the time of year. Um, sometimes at Thanksgiving time, Christmas, we are up to 89, 90 families. Anything that you can get at the supermarket, meats. We have a lot of dairy products, a lot of canned goods, fresh produce, mostly in the summertime, and often get shampoo, personal care items, uh, soaps, shampoos, toothpaste, um, sometimes diapers. The affiliation with the food bank in Worcester allows people to come once a month but because we have other donations and outside donations from school, um, school collections, the Girl Scouts, Boy Scouts, different organizations throughout the town um, also donate food so people can come a little bit more often than once a month. We are open at the food pantry on Mondays from 10 in the morning till noon. And then again on Monday afternoon from 4 to 6. And on Thursdays from noon to 2 in the afternoon. You don't need an appointment. Um, like I said, the eligibility goes through the um, state for uh, requirements. And, and we, if they do not have a referral from a social service organization, um, then we ask them to maybe go to some place like Catholic Charities that um, will see if there's other um, services that are available for them. We can always use items that kids bring in their school lunches. Um, a lot of, we have a lot of uh, big families that have kids bringing school lunches, um, so that kind of stuff. In the winter time, a lot of soup. Um, in the summer, maybe more um, canned goods that can keep better in the summer. Donations to the food pantry are accepted all year long. Most needed in the summertime when kids are home, families have, you know, the kids are home from school and have a lot more times that their meals eat, being eaten at home. Um, we have a lot of people at Thanksgiving time, Christmas time that more people want to help, um, but the need is all year long. To this food pantry, if you would like to donate food, um, can be left in the back of the St. Dennis Church. That gets checked every day. Um, food is brought over to the pantry here at the rectory. 
If you want to bring it directly to the rectory, um, just call and make sure somebody's here. Monetary donations are always accepted. Uh, we have a, an account at the Worcester County Food Bank that we um, deposit money into and the money is drawn down as we can, we can buy items um, that normally don't get distributed to food pantries that we can purchase. Always can use volunteer help. We can use you know, cleaning, stocking shelves, um, helping building shelves. If you would like to volunteer at the food pantry, you can call the St. Dennis Rectory, which is 508-476-2002.